Meet Professor Robert Uman. He is an Israeli mathematician. He was born in 1930 in Germany and fled with his family to the United States in 1938, right before the Kristallnacht pogroms. In the 1950s, he joined the Hebrew University of Jerusalem. His greatest contribution was in the realm of repeated games. Oh, and yes, he also won the 2005 Nobel Prize in Economic Sciences for being the first to define the concept of correlated equilibrium in game theory. What is game theory, you ask? Well, let's hear it from Professor Uman himself. A game theory is uh, uh, the science of interaction between different entities that interact with each other and strive to different goals. The strategic aspect of this uh, interaction is what game theory is about. So each side takes into account that the other side driving to a different goal from him. The simplest example is a game. Of chess, you know that the other side is uh, striving to exactly the opposite of what you're striving to. You make a certain move, you have to tell you put yourself now into the position of the other side and say, what, how will the other side respond to that move? So you have to test whether your moves are sound on the basis of how the other side will respond. You have to put yourself in their shoes. Similarly, for various applications like the economics, business, law, where the sides do not necessarily strive to opposite goals, but they strive to different goals. In a war, if you make a certain move, if you advance troops to a certain position, you have to ask yourself, what is going to be the response of the other side to that, to that move of yours. So it's, it's really, in principle, it's exactly the same thing. Well, I would tell any young man, and I do tell a lot of young men, or women, yes, uh, when they ask me, I say, do what you like, okay? Do what you like. Don't listen to your parents. Don't listen to your teachers. If you have discovered something that you like to do, if you like to play the drums, go ahead and play drums, yes. What you like to do is what you're gonna do best, and so just do what you like to do.